Hello everybody, it's Erica with Not Your Average EGC, and today we are talking about week three of the Para 3 testing. We are almost at the end, guys. It has been a journey. Uh, next week will be the last week of the consecutive testing of the Para 3. And every week I've been doing an update, so we're just going to buzz through it real quick. Not too many changes from the beginning of testing. I have nothing bad to say about this knife. Nothing. It is a killer EDC knife. Uh, borderline hard use. I have been doing everything with this knife, and it is outperforming my expectations by a long shot. I really thought I was going to break this, or that it would fail, or that I would just hate it. And I'm obsessed with it, and I love it. I have still only sharpened it once. I'm probably going to sharpen it tonight. Um, maybe not sharpen, actually. I'll probably strop it tonight. And I would be really surprised and excited if we were able to get through this whole testing with just one sharpen. Like, that would be crazy. Um, this steel is great. Ergos are fantastic. A lot of people have been messaging me saying that this palm swell right here, they don't like it. I have not had an issue with it at all. It's very comfortable, never gets in the way when I'm holding it like this or like this, any which way. Doesn't bother me at all. It's just fantastic, guys. I have used the, the tip of it to pull splinters. I got a few really bad ones the other day. One of them is actually still in my finger, but I was able to like get part of it out. Um, been cutting everything under the sun with it. It is just a beast. It is absolutely fantastic. So I don't see that changing within the next week, uh, but just an update of how it's going. It's going very well. And I think what I will do at the end of this testing is do like a rapid test of a couple knives throughout November. Uh, I was thinking about it and I was going to do a full blown month test of the lightweight pair of three, but I really don't think that's necessary. I already have my impressions of the model. The lightweight version, I really don't think is going to change my impressions. Uh, it's essentially the same. So I think what I'll do is like a week test of this just to see how I like the lightweight version. And I'm also curious to see how that awesome Cerakote holds up. That's by Rec Custom Shop. And definitely a little curious to see how this CTS BD 1N steel does. Um, I've never used that before, so a little curious about that. But at a mo the model as a whole, I'm not exactly sure I have to test it for a month because it's really not that different. Uh, and I more or less just want to get like an idea of how this works. That way I can compare it to the Delica which will be tested for a month, and the bug out. I'm very curious to see which one of these three I like the most. So that'll be fun. Um, I think I'll probably carry these two for a month straight and just get an idea with this one for a week. But we'll see. We'll see what happens. Those are just ideas rolling around in my head. Let me know what you guys think down in the comments. Um, if there's anything in particular you want to see in November. But I, I think that would be a good plan. But honestly, if you've been on the fence about a pair of three, like, just grab one, dude. These things are sick. I'm so glad that I listened to you guys and gave it a third try. Because uh, the, the first two left a really bitter taste in my mouth. And... This one I'm just obsessed with. Like, this is such a badass knife. I love it. So, yeah. Just wanted to do a, a quick update. I gotta go walk the dogs. It's cold out. And it's a very busy day. So, quick video for today. But, um, again, yeah, let me know what you guys want to see down in the comments. It's just between these choices for now because I gotta get that testing out of the way for these. I really need to just get all of these lightweight FRN knives out of the way. That way we can test some of that really fun stuff that I have out back, like the uh, the Headless Horseman and the Mini Crooked River. Those will be fun. Anyway, guys, have a great day. Hope your weekend was awesome. 
And as always, you can guess what I'm going to say. Use your shit. Have a good one.